right, you guys, I know it's late, really late in the day. I did not do my digital couponing today. Me and my husband went to the farmer's market and we got some stuff. I got some coffee and then I went out today to get like cat food and cat litter at Walmart and I couldn't help looking at the clearance in the craft aisle again. And then I went to Dollar Tree and picked up some vinyls and glitters and stuff. So I wanted to show you what I picked up. And I know I'm not in the kitchen of my camper. I'm in the bedroom because I left my, um, my stand for my phone, um, down in my workstation because I was filming um, a cup video today and other stuff this morning. So um, I forgot to bring it back in my camper and I didn't feel like going downstairs to get it. So I'm just gonna quickly show you what I got from Walmart and from Dollar Tree today. So uh, I'm gonna start with this shirt. This one was $3 but I thought this was a beautiful color. This is a large, um, and this is, it says relaxed and it's time and true. So I got my heat press, my mini heat press to start making shirts and stuff like that with my iron on transfer vinyls. So I have several, um, well, I have three, images like that I kind of made up for shirts. They're funny ones. Um, I'll show you them right here. And those are shirt ideas that I kind of, I saw some as stickers. I saw some as shirts on Timo and I was like, I want to see if I can recreate those, um, and make that and make them look really cute. Um, just, and adding my own little flair to them. So I just thought those were really cute. I have others that I'm working on. Um, and those are just templates, but that's what we'll cut out and go on the shirt. So if you guys want, um, shirts, anything like that, just let me know um in the comments down below or shoot me an email or dm me on instagram everything will be in the like my email and my instagram handles in the description box down below um and you can contact me that way or through the comments and then i'll give you my email or something um i just need to know which design you want what size or if there's something you want me to kind of create just let me know uh, and i'll be more than happy to create stuff for you guys because I'm excited to start getting shirts made. All right, so anyways, back to my haul. This was 3X, but I just, like for an oversized t-shirt or something, I just, I couldn't pass it up for a dollar. I thought it was the cutest thing in the world. It's Looney Tunes, it's Bugs Bunny, it's got That's All Folks on it, Rascal, What's Up Doc? Um, and then Don't Come between bugs and carrots. I, I just, I couldn't, I couldn't not buy that for a dollar. Um, even if it's just a lounger on the house t-shirt, I'm fine with that. Then for a dollar, I got this shirt right here and this is time and true size small. It's a gray. It's like, um, just an oversized t-shirt kind of thing. That's a little bit stretchy. It's thin material. I just thought these would be perfect for shirts to make. Then I got another one in a size small, time and true. This one's got a V-neck, but it's that stretchy material, a dollar, green, oversized. Then I got, this is a small, and this is like a real small. So this small actually says... Yeah, four to six. So this is oversized, this is fitted. And it's a really pretty, like rust, brownish orange kind of color, a dollar. And then I got a gray one for a dollar. This is time, this is no boundaries. And this is an extra large fitted shirt in gray. Long sleeve. 
both of those were long sleeves, obviously. Um, and then every time I go to Walmart, I go to the glitter section. So I picked up a thing of glitter. This is rose gold in the Sunlin, so Sulin brand. And these are three. 47 or something like that and then I got another one of these yesterday my husband bought it for me and I sh I'll show you this um it's not in the camper right now but I'll show you which one it is it's really pretty I like had mermaid cup ideas in my head all right so here's the glitter it's called midnight gem oh, it's gorgeous I just I keep getting mermaid vibes from it I thought it would be cute to like make a mermaid cup or I think I have mermaid keychain molds coming. Like, oh, I cannot wait to use this. It's so gorgeous. It's like purples and blues and like green shift. Like, look at that. So pretty. I just thought it was completely gorgeous. So that is all that I got from Walmart besides my cat food and my cat litter. Then at Dollar Tree, I got four vinyls. So I got gray. And these are just regular, not iron-on. Um, I don't think I want to buy the iron-on ones there because they're all neon colors. And I I need, like, normal kind of colors. Um, but this is gray. And then I got a deep blue. I got a red. And I got a yellow. And by the way, those images that I showed you for my shirts that I made up, I can also put them on cups or whatever you want them on. Um, it does, it's not just reserved for shirts because I can shrink the images and put them on a cup or something like that. So let me know if you want those on a cup instead of a shirt. I don't know. Just let me know if you guys, like I'm doing custom orders right now. Um... Like, I am only one person, but I'm not backed up right now with orders. So, if you guys want custom orders, just let me know. I'll be more than happy to make them. That way, I'm not making things that aren't going to sell. I will be making things that you guys want to buy. And then I got this glitter right here. This is a pretty, like, pink. Then I got this pack of three glitters. So, there's a fine glitter right here in green there's a glitter right here that's like a little bit more chunky and then stars right there i just thought they were so cute and then a five pack of glitters here so there's silver rose gold um what is here and these are like there's these are more like foily kind of glitters um, there's silver, regular gold, and then there's like a deep pink. So yeah, I'm trying to stock up on vinyls. I'm trying to stock up on glitters. I'm trying to stock up on materials and all that so that I have a pretty good selection and then I can just sell and then I don't have to stock up for a good while and then I can just get deals as I see them instead of going out and searching for them all the time. So I feel like in this kind of industry, you kind of have to spend money to make money. So that's kind of where I'm at at this point right now is putting out the money for materials and then slowly building up my business. But yeah, that is everything for today. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, leave a comment, and if you haven't already, please subscribe. Thank you for watching. Have an awesome day. Bye.